Alright, so welcome back to our YouTube channel. Uh, don't forget to like, subscribe if you're new. And in today's video, we have a very special video for you guys today. We're going to be showcasing a 150 million crew rating account. As you can see on your screen, we're going to be showing our man Stevie Beavy's account. Shout out to him for allowing us to go on his account and showcase his account to you guys because this account is absolutely insane. Uh, it is VIP 18, however, there is one thing I do want to show you guys at the very start of the video, is this guy has been playing the game ever since he came out. So if we quickly go to the events tab, just show you guys how long this guy has been playing, how old this account is. Um, so if we go to daily sign in, 1327 days. Yes, over three and a half years, this guy has been playing the game. That's the longest person I've ever seen play this game. It's also one of the strongest accounts that I've ever been able to go on. Um, it's absolutely insane. It's easily a top 10 account in the entire game. Yes, this account is top 10 world. Absolutely insane account. Um, so a massive thanks to CVBV once again for allowing us to go on his account and show you guys this video for today. So it's absolutely amazing. Yeah, as you guys can see, his original server was server 6 at the top here. He is level 120, which is completely max level in the game, if you guys didn't know that. Um, so he started on the 6th server in the entire game. 6. Which is absolutely insane. Um, as you guys can see, his gold is 4 billion gold. So if you guys want any gold, just hit up uh, Stevie here. And yeah, he has 4 billion gold, by the way. Um, so the first thing we're going to be going over is let's just go into the growth section because some of this stuff on this account is absolutely insane but this is probably the most insane account you guys will probably ever witness uh, but let's jump into the scroll index and show you guys how much he actually has so he has 985,000 card score 985,000 so uh, as we go through all the attack characters he has pretty much every single attack character Except Nikoluffy, I believe, at level 7. Yep, every single one at level 7 besides Nikoluffy. And we go to the tank characters. All level 7. We go to the skill characters. The only one he doesn't have is obviously the newest character. The Beast Pirates combo isn't level 7. And Zoria Ashura, Zeus Nami. So just the three recent characters. That's legitimately all he's got left. Uh, but the group index is where this account is really strong. He has so much group indexes. Look at this. Absolutely insane. Look how many level 10s he has. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. 20 level 10 group indexes. That's not counting all these level 9s as well. I believe he has almost all of them unlocked. The only two he hasn't unlocked are the ones for Interservice Summit War. Uh, you have to get rank 1 or 2 in Interservice Summit War Final Phase. So they're the only two. They're also the hardest two in the game, which makes sense that they're the only two. But yeah, absolutely insane. Almost 1 million card score. Yeah, that is crazy. Let's go ahead and look at his talent points because this is probably insane. <laughs> Yeah, 30 on every single one. This one, 30 on these two, 20 plus on most of them. Um, 20 plus on most of these as well. I thought this one would be a little bit higher. Um, but the first one's completely maxed. He's obviously maxed the three that you should only max on this entire page. Um, if you ever get to the expertise one, is Arena, Vanquisher, War, and Expert of Vanquisher. Mind War and Guild War, no one really cares about. So yeah, they're the three that you should max there. But overall, absolutely insane talent points. Nevertheless, um, we'll go over his characters a little bit later in the video. His pirate ships all completely maxed. Now he has 158,000 still sitting here. But yeah, if we go through every single one of them, they're all completely maxed. As you would expect from a top 10 account. Yep, there we go. As we go into the intelligence collection, as you guys will see, his intelligence collection isn't actually that insane. So if we go to the rankings, obviously Nateru, you know, rank 1-2 world, 
literally has 1.36 million almost. Now, you don't actually need very high intelligence collection to be very strong in this game. You don't need that. Even my account is only like 500 or 600k. Like Stevie's at 732k and he's still top 10. Like you don't need to expendage so much uh, gold or diamonds. You should never use diamonds in intelligence and collection in my opinion. It's just a waste. So if we just go into some of these characters. He doesn't have any of the diamond ones. None of the diamond ones. Because there's no need for it. It's just a waste of diamonds in my opinion. Um, so yeah, most of them will be 11 and 12%. Obviously all of them are locked because it's very easy. Um, then let's go to his speed. His speed is 122,000 speed in arena. Absolutely insane. We just go over some of the characters that he has speed for. Actually quite interesting to see his Nika Luffy speed. 1400 on Nika Luffy. Really insane there. 700 on those two. I believe some of these older characters you have insane speed on. Uh, like Naomi Valentine's Day, she probably has like 3k speed. Yeah, 2.7k level 400. That's completely maxed. Um, that's the highest speed I believe you can get is level 400. 1500 on his... And then also, yeah, another 2.9k speed on his Zephyr. Yeah, absolutely insane. I believe his category might be maxed as well. Yeah, level 400 as well. So yeah, if you guys were wondering what's the max level for friendship, it's level 400. Yeah, absolutely insane. And then the pirate flags. Obviously, this guy has probably all the exclusive pirate flags, except for the newest one. Um, yeah, Nikoluffy flag, he has an army Val flag, obviously as you guys can see he has most of the characters 6, 7 star in the entire game. Sh he, yeah, he should have every single flag. He, he has every flag in the game, I'm pretty sure. Which is not surprising. Does he have... The only two flags I believe he doesn't have is Zoro and... Uh, the newest Beast Pirates, which makes sense because Zoro's only been out for one uh, event. It was complete trash, the Blessing event, and so was the Beast Pirates. It's very hard to get... Pla it's very hard to get the character's flags on the Blessing event. It's so RNG and it's really bad. Um, obviously, he's unlocked all the Pony Glyphs, so level 30, 30, 30, and 30. Absolutely amazing. They're all max level. So if you guys didn't know, the max level for Pony Glyphs is level 30. So completely maxed on Pony Glyphs. Um, let's go over and check out his combo cards. Obviously he has every combo card in the game. Now some of his combo cards are quite insane. His SAL is absolutely insane. Look at this SAL. Level 71, 71, 71, 60, 60, 50, 50. Absolutely insane. Uh, the Beast Pirates, we did get to three mount slots, so working on that at the moment. The other ones aren't that great, so there's no point in even going over them. Hero Saga, obviously maxed, very easy for in-game players, even I have it maxed. Um, so there's no reason to go over that, but his Sea Kings on this account, uh, yeah, completely maxed. As you would expect, so he has every single Sea King 5 star, tier 5 by the way, completely maxed. As you can see down here, 5 star, tier 5, completely maxed. Yeah, the maximum you can get. So that's his growth section. And yeah, let's just go over some of the characters he has. And then his backpack later on, because this account is absolutely insane. But yeah, as you guys can see, two combo cards obviously at the top are going to be the strongest. 42, almost 43 million SAL. Absolutely insane. I have seen some 50 million SALs, but nevertheless, this is absolutely insane. Red plus one. Level 105 on some of the gear levels. You know, all these characters as well, if you're wondering, are going to be potential six. Like, this account is insane. I think almost every single character he has is potential six. 
which is nuts. Uh, even the newest combo, the Beast Pirates, is potential 6 if you're running. 27 million, potential 6. Uh, Kaido Dragon Form. Again, 19 million, potential 6. General Frankie. Uh, almost 18 million, potential 6. Nico Luffy. Uh, 17 million, potential 6 as well. Like I'm telling you guys, this guy has almost every single character, potential 6. Uh, potential 6 Zuzunami, as you can see. Like, almost every single character, if not every single character, is potential 6. If we go to Law, is Law potential 6. Bullet, potential 6. Like, this account is insane. Top 10 account. I'll just check Luffy Tower. I'm pretty sure he's potential 6. Everything's potential 6, yeah. I think you guys get the point. This can is absolutely insane as we just scroll through all the characters. Like so many red level characters. All potential 6. Yeah, absolutely insane. Yeah, absolutely insane. 153 million. If you guys want to see how much his... Top 10 account very easily as you guys can see. The last thing I do want to show you guys in this account is his backpack because it's actually very interesting to see. Since this account has been running for over three and a half years, uh, you can find some crazy things on people's account in their uh, backpacks. Uh, a lot of things you guys will have never even seen in the entire game will be in this guy's backpack uh, because the account obviously is th over three and a half years old. But yeah, just look at this. 38 red adventure soul chests if you need a red adventure souls there you go he has so much chests he still has diamond chests 286 talent points sitting there and he has so much chests like i don't even know what this is you can choose it when you get marshall to teach of shanks 185 shards sitting there you know, 204 golden hero selection chests sitting there don't even know what this is, but you can select a seeking. I didn't even know they did this. Selection seeking boxes. These are old ones. I've actually never seen those boxes before. Like 4,500 shards of any of these characters. No, 1,200 shards of any weapon he wants. Another almost 3k shards here. You know, it's absolutely insane. 2.6k shards here. Another 640 shards here. He has so many selection boxes. But here's another one. Uh, that you can choose Seekings. 140 shards. Obviously he has all of them completely maxed. So it's useless to him at the moment. Until they update him. Another 1100 shards. Like He has so many boxes. Another 1900. Do you need any weapons? Another 1900 shards there. Uh, what is this box? I've never seen this box before. Oh, this must be a very old event. I don't know what this event is. Um, but yeah, there are so many old boxes like this event. It's very old. I've never seen this box before. Yeah, this account is absolutely insane. 133 Adventure Soul Waken Gems. Um, it's insane. 45,000 deck scrolls just sitting there. 19,000... <laughs> common oh man i wish they bring that i wish they would bring back this event 836 stones sadly they'll never bring back that event you know a thousand shots for rayleigh 883 1100 2002 2800 almost has an extra 154 luffy shards yeah it has so many shards look look at nami val this is obviously abusing a, a, a very old bug in the game. Um, but 6,700 Nami Valentine's Day shards. <laughs> extra Seeking shards, he has, he has extra 360 Zunisha shards. Extra 820 Inshore shards. And now we get to the vintage stuff of the account. Look at all these discount codes. 
Look at all these discount coupons that will never be used. That's just left in the box. There's so many. And here are some of these old items. I do remember this one actually. But yeah, some of these are from like old, old CT. Uh, old, old bag events if you know those events in the game. It's just so much vintage stuff in this game. Like, just look at all these kaiju stones he has. So we're going up 158k of those. 12,000 badges. 10,000. Some of this stuff, I've never seen any of this stuff before. These hats and stuff, these exchange items. Yamato Kazuki Sailing Journal, no idea what that is, probably for an exchange event. I've never seen this before. Very old Easter 2021 coupon. Like, there is some really old stuff I've never seen before. Oh, the old exchange event for weapons. Sad that'll probably never come back in the game. Same as this one for pirate flags. 3,300? Jesus. If you don't know this event, you could exchange uh, 300 of these for uh, an exclusive pirate flag. So technically he has 11 pirate flags sitting there if this event ever comes back in the game. That's insane. 15,000 Guild War badges. 4.4k Vanquisher. And then we have all these old... Exchange items here. This counts crazy. If you guys want some like, flags, two chopper flags sitting here. These are just so much extra flags. Two Kaido Dragon Form flags. Look at all the Nami Val flags from the old CT bug. Fujitora, you need some Blackbeard flags. He's got four extra there. Jesus. It's absolutely insane account. Yeah, you guys get the point. There's so much stuff. This account is absolutely insane. So yeah, I really hope you guys enjoyed the rundown of the 153 million top 10 account in the game. Uh, thanks to Stevie Beavy, and I hope to see you guys in the next video.